Yeah. Would help if I unmuted myself. <laughs> Hello. Hello, welcome back. I am still around. Uh, here is your ASMR for the weekend. That was a noisy one. There we go. Hope we're all doing well. Honest Garmil. Hello, friendo. Long time no see. How are you? How is little one? Hope things are well with you. Uh, for anybody that doesn't know, hello. This is a uh, Barrett solo run of Final Fantasy VII. Uh, we are uh, just cracking on with the story. Small human is practicing his makeup for lot. That is awesome. We're going. Is small human going to LARP then? Is small human going to get to LARP before me? That's uh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> that doesn't make me look particularly great. Now, there is something we need to do first before we go to Medeal. There is something we need to do as a form of future proofing. I believe we can land. This still counts as. Wu Tai area, right? Yeah, as long as we don't go up there, I think we're fine. We don't want to do the Wu Tai side quest, that'll take too long. But we do want to get into a fight with something here where we need an enemy skill that might be useful later on. I don't think it's any of these, but you need to die anyway. Oof, right in the face. That's good. We like when we get healed by stuff. She might be dead after this anyway. She is now. She's okay, folks. Well, she's not okay. It's the actually it's the opposite of okay, but you know, it's fine. Do you have anything useful? I don't think you're the fella I'm after, but oh, there's the counter. Electric burst, eh? Uh, I don't think either of those are enemy skills, so... Ooh, so that's like a lightning three attack, okay. Will it absorb lightning? Let's find out. It will, okay. This is actually not the fellow I wanted to fight, but it's okay. I wonder if we can just run away from this now. We sure can. We don't need that experience anyway. What we need is a little wee grass Pokemon looking fella. Who has an ability called Magic Hammer. And I believe it's down here somewhere on this grassy patch. I might be entirely wrong. The internet may have led me astray. But I do believe it's down here. That's the fella! So what we need to do is manipulate you. Or one of them that's not dead. Come on, you can do it, Barrett. It doesn't matter which one you manipulate, really, as long as it's one of them. There we go. Nailed it. So we are going to lose some MP for this, but it's so that we can learn a skill. Magic Hammer. That's the one we want. Bonk. Cool. That's going to be super useful later on. Oh, we don't need to worry about the rest of this now. We got what we came for. Right, let's go to Medeal. We can move on with the story now. Yes, but that magic hammer could be super useful when we come to fight carry armor. Because one of the strategies... Ca carry armor is going to be difficult. Carry armor is going to be a nightmare. But one of the strategies I read is that you can use magic hammer to uh, get rid of most if not all of its MP and then uh, 
it can't keep doing its lapis laser doodad move. Which could be a game changer. Midil. Uh, I need to remember what I need to do here. I mean, there are many things I can do here, but... Uh, what do we need? What do we need? What do we need? Ethers could be useful, but I think I'd rather make sure that Barrett can get a new weapon first if he needs one. I didn't buy anything. You're more than welcome. I don't have any greens to give you, so that's fine. I can't remember what you give me. It's something kind of borderline useful, but... I'm sure I'll get by without it. Do, 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 do. Right, now I've checked this locked. Now we can go and... Oh, wait, hold on. Is this a weapon store, though? Sorry about the frantic chocobo music. It just happens. It's just a thing. Uh, yeah, you go. Perfect. A new weapon for you. We will take it. Still angle's not as good, so that's fine. Thank you, so. Let's get the peaceful music back on. Perfect. Right. So, micro laser. So, this has the same amount of slots, but it hits harder, which is fine and dandy by me. I don't think we need manipulate anymore either. Should I go buy another HP plus materia? I can get them from. Cosmo Canyon. Hey, Liam from the East. Long time to see, buddy. How's it going, friendo? Hope you're doing well. Hey, Scotch Seeker as well. The whole party's here. This is lovely stuff. How are you all doing? It has been. It has indeed been a while. Hope you've all been uh, staying out of trouble while I've not been around. Where? There it is. Glad to hear it. Glad to hear it, buddy. Bit hungry. <laughs> Use the beat up old key. But then we tell the truth. Yeah. Always tell the truth. <laughs> Lie your butt off. No, tell them the truth. That door's just painted on. Uh, no sign of Frenchie at the moment. I think Frenchie is off doing Frenchy things. But she sends... I know uh, I've chatted to her recently and she uh, she passes on her best regards to everybody. Out me we chocobo person. Right, you gave me the cursor ring. I'm never actually going to use... Am I going to use it? Mm, I can't think of a context where I would use it. If I was using Tifa, I would absolutely use it. But I don't think I need it for this particular run. Sad dog noises. But it is very good to see you all again. Very nice to have you along. Uh, the wife shouted at me so bad she lost her voice for a moment and laughed. It was glory. <laughs> yeah, that does sound like Frenchie. Let's go see Cloud. We don't need him, but uh, let's go check in on him. I'm sure he won't be a vegetable. Oh, he's a vegetable. Oh, well, you know, these things happen. How are you doing, Cloudo? Oh, dear. Sad music. So when I was a kid, I was never quite sure what that kind of rhythmic squeaking sound is meant to be. I thought it might be the wheelchair, but that doesn't make any sense because he's not moving. Then I thought it might be like a... Um, 
you know, like a, uh, a breathing apparatus, something to help him breathe. But he's not showing any signs that he's, like, struggling to breathe. So I still don't know exactly what that sound is, in all honesty. Well, uh, Kiddo and I are trying different makeup and costumes for his first lap while watching musicals. That sounds like, I honestly, that sounds like a way more fun evening. I would totally spend the time doing that. <laughs> but look away, that's absolutely fine, appreciated. Any particular musical? Any any preferences? I'll be honest, I'm not too au fait with many musicals. Unless Disney films count as musicals. They've got songs in them. Right, Tifa's staying put here. That's fine. We don't care. He's letting come from away. Oh, I don't think I've ever heard that one. I will have to check it out. We have to have this discussion inside. Can't just say it here and now, so that's fine. Dum, da, do, dum. You stay put, Teefs. Now, the team's going to make the foolish mistake of putting Sid in charge, but we all know who's really in charge around here. Tis our boy, Barrett. <laughs> ah, yes, this is where we learn about the big, large, huge, throbbing materia. I think. And we start off on the mini quest to go and get them. Now one's easier than the other. The Fort Condor one's easy. We'll just let them get to the top and we'll fight the chicken monster thing. Whatever's at the top. I can't remember what it is. It's some sort of monster that's not very hard to kill. The one that's on the train going into Corel will be tougher. Because we're on the clock and we've only got Barrett. So that could be a bit more of a, an issue. We can get away with like failing. We'll just miss out on... Barrett's ultimate uh, limit break, which actually technically isn't as good as his second to last limit break, which we've already got. And we won't get the ultimate material, which would be useful. So I guess we're going to, I mean, we're going to try and do it, obviously, whatever happens, but I don't think it's super duper essential to manage it. Barrett's doubting himself, but it should be Barrett who's in charge. Don't trust this moron. Listen to the music. This tells you this is a bad idea. If only the real world had music playing to set the mood. I, it would make life so much easier if there was like a theme tune running for every situation. You'd be like, okay, I know based on the music what is happening here. Uh, uh, operation room. Is that where we need to go? I guess so. Oh, we should... I don't think I've ever used you. Yeah, let's give you something crappy. Yeah, you don't need that. You're going to die. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, that is the shittiest thing I've given. Okay, cool, 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 cool. 
Okay, so we have to do the Corel reactor first. Did you just tell Barrett to fuck off, Sid? We're gonna have um, we're gonna have disagreements if that's how we're gonna treat things here. Uh, well, you're dead. So that makes life a bit quicker. Probably should save as well. Oh, I have to talk to you to save, obviously. Got him out of the loop. Okay. Right, on to Corel. Uh, back this way. Although we can actually, there's a few things we can pick up in Medil if we head back in first. So, we might do that first of all. There's a house that we can't get to the first time. Specifically this house. Uh, oh yes, there you go. Hip, hip, hip. Elixir, thank you. Did I take something? Yeah, I took about it. Always tell the truth, kids. Apart from if telling the lie gets you out of trouble, then tell the lie. Life lessons. Right, let's go to Corel. Which means we need to go... We're pressing the right button first of all. Uh, I've got sun cream in my eyes now. Um, we need to go... What's the quickest way to get there? What is the quickest way to get there? Back from Corel, I would assume. Is this Corel? This is Corel. Perfect. Uh, is Barrett not fully healed up? That's slightly annoying. Um, let's... Ugh. Oh, I've landed right on the village there. That can't be good for tourism. Do I want to be patched up? Uh, let's just use a 10. I can't be bothered to go all the way back into this ship. I haven't got two of them. Actually, you know what? I'm being lazy. I'm being super duper lazy and that's not okay. Oh, we can do Fort Condor first. Interesting. I don't think there's any point because it's... We have to do both anyway. Let's just do Corel while we're here. Patch us up, please. Thank you. Now, we must make sure that Sid and Kate Sith are dead before we start the train bit, because that's time I cannot afford to waste. Land. No, not on that side of him. Stupid. This time, with feeling. So I have to go back up this way if memory serves. Oh, uh, don't want to fight. No bombs, please. No bombs. There's going to be a bomb. I can't help it. There will be a bomb. Any second now. There it is. Although, this could be a good chance to kill my friends. No, don't take damage for them, you... Oh, wow. Christ. Barrett was not fucking around there. Dead? Mm, not quite. 50 HP. Boo. Bomb on a bridge is a good chance to kill your friends. Life lessons! Again. <laughs> now there is an outside chance I could kill this bomb, but... Eh. Well, apparently the bomb doesn't want me to leave. I really don't want to kill you, bomb, but I guess we'll try it. Oh, never mind. I was worried about nothing. Listen, bombs scare me, alright? In Final Fantasy history, they're bad news. 
Me and Bombs have a track record. We have a we have a complicated past. I should have gone the other way. Going the other way is much quicker than going this way. I'm teaching lab lessons. <laughs> I should never be allowed to pay PC. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I would argue with that, but it's incredibly true. God, remember the first time I came through here, and these were like major issues. Although they were good for grinding, so. Do, 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 do. You can counter-attack any time now, Barrett. You know that, right? Nope. Alright. That's fine. You do you, buddy. And you got your fancy new gun. Oh, wrong button. So when we get to the end, we have to do like a... Um... Oh, there's a save point right before it, though. That actually... Okay, going this way was a better idea, because there's a save point right before the whole... Um train sequence. So even if things go bad, we won't have to go too far back to try again. That makes me happy. Right. Let's give this the old college try. Oh, come on. I just want to get there. <laughs> Now, these things were bad the first time around, but I think we're probably strong enough to kill them now. Yeah, no worries. Sure if they keep missing as well. Da -dum -dum. Ah, 16 HP. Hi guys! Hi guys! You guys are... Barrett and Co! Good try buddy, I'm immune! Ow! Oh nice! <laughs> and we stopped him as well. Have, honestly, having um... Added effect and time magic on my weapon is a, the, the smartest thing I've done in a very long time. I know the bar's not super high for that, but you know. You take your wins where you can get them. Now what the hell buttons is it going to be on the keyboard? This is where I could be in trouble. Do, 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 do. On to our spare train. I wonder how they're going to do this in the uh, the remake series. Probably a lot more in depth and involved, but yeah, we'll see. Now, which buttons is it going to be, sir? Okay, which buttons is it? Got to find my rhythm. I'm just gonna hit both at the same time. Something will happen. Nearly got it, nearly got it, nearly got it. There we go. 30 seconds, not too bad. Now we've got a fight on each of these lovely carriages. 
Let's hope it's not too bad. Nice. I thought that was all right. All right, this fella shouldn't be too bad. Can we kill it with just one hit, though? Because we might want to use something a bit more aggressive if we have it. Yeah, maybe I should be using... I've got, like, Bolt 2. Bolt 2, might. Yeah, it's not doing... Our actual physical attacks are doing more than that. So this is what we're slightly concerned about. It's just going to take us a little bit longer to do each one. Go, 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 go. We don't care, we don't care. Right, quick health kick. I do. What's next? Uh, I forget what we got on here. Oh, two of them. Okay, well, maybe we can use something a bit more big boy. Uh... I might do it. Try and do some good damage. Oh, we're going to get a limit break. Never mind. That's even better. Perfecto! Something leveled up. Don't care what it is. We'll look at that later on. Onibar! Ah, now you're going to be the main problem here, aren't you? Uh, Aqualum should be pretty bad for it. Oh, yeah, there you go. That's doing some damage. Ow. Mind you, talking of damage, he's doing quite a lot to me. Uh, Aqualum. I might reduce it slightly. Reduced it quite a lot. But you missed me, so that's useful. Not the second time, though. No. Must go quicker, Barrett. God, he's still going. I'm going to have to heal up now as well. Eey. No, I should have saved that limit break for uh, this fella. Please stop hitting me. God, he's still going? This guy is tanky. Yeah, healing is back on the cards again. Definitely back on the cards now. Barrett, do you want to counter-attack at any point? Luckily, if he hits us one more time, we'll get our limit break, and that should finish him off. Ooh, nice decrit, though. Never mind, if we use an elixir after this, we'll be more or less back up to full HP. There we go. Do we have an elixir? That's a good question. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we have one. Perfect, perfect, perfect. This is a flying bird, so I think uh, trying's going to be a good chunk. I did steal one from that old man. You're absolutely right. See, stealing pays off, kids. Always steal. Always be stealing. Oh, I did Aqualung. Well, it doesn't matter. It'll still do damage to it. No, or it won't do anything. Trine is the way to go, apparently. Where is Trine? There's Trine. We might still be alright. It's going to be tight. There you go. That's the one that's doing the damage. Wish I did that first time. Never mind. We learn. Still going, huh? Keeping half an hour on that clock now. Come on, are you just wasting time? Ah, oh, man, how is he not dead? <laughs> God, 
to stay on the offensive here, really. Barrett, could you counterattack at any point? Yay, counterattack! Ah. Uh, I need this to kill it, really. How these small does it fit on a small train? It's a good question. It's a very valid question. How are you not dead? Oh god, I'm so much trouble. Uh, I think we have to cure. Which is going to make timing a bit of a try. If we can finish off the last guy on the last thing quick, we'll be alright. Kill it? No. Need you to kill it, please. Oh god, it's still going? This thing is like, got a million HP. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh god, it's still alive. Okay, we can still do this, as long as this kills it. Three minutes should be enough. Okay. We are going to be squeaky bum time, but it's doable. We've got an potion out of that, that's fine. I'm not even going to bother healing, we're just going to go. Actually, no, I'm going to... No, I'm not. I'm just going to go for it. Right. We kill this guy. We try and stop it. Everything goes fine. I might need to heal up, though, as a starting point. I don't know how much this guy can hit for. A little bit. Not much. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. That column should fuck him up. There you go. Right, now we've got to stop the train. Come on, we've got two minutes to stop the train. That should be plenty of time. Stop celebrating! <laughs> come on, I'm hammering, hammering the okie dokie button. Let's just go. So it's up and menu. Down and cancel. Okay, we're fine. We did it. Soldier throwing a grenade on a train. <laughs> Sometimes the games make no sense. <laughs> yeah, the grenade just like... Backs into the face. Never mind. Successful. Da 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 etc. Right. We're done. That was unnecessarily complicated. Uh, if we talk to out my way. There we go. Yeah, I mean I think it seemed more stressful than it needed to be. I think that was actually okay. Just goes to show, if you had the full party as well, that'd be a cakewalk. Give me Ultima now, please. And then somebody gives me Catastrophe. I think it's like a guy in a tent somewhere. Oh, it's going to let us rest. Perfect. Even better. We will get Catastrophe while we're here, because why not? I don't... I've just stayed here. Thank you for your time, though. Uh, who is the man who gives me... It's not you, is it? Is it you? Uh, nope. One of these tents down here? Okay, not you. You? Oh, who gives me catastrophe? I'm sure somebody gives me catastrophe. I don't need it anyway, it's fine. It's 
It's fine. Everybody's alive again, which is not fine, but we'll deal with it. Right, quick save. Probably should check what leveled up there. I could do with regen, so a few more to get that. Uh, don't need manipulate anymore. Oh, that's right, I was going to get... Well, I'll have luck plus for now, that's fine. Right, off to... Whoa, okay, press the wrong button. Fort Condor, which is down this way. That went a lot more smoothly than I thought it was going to. I thought that could have been a bit of a... Uh, bit of an issue. But it wasn't too bad. This isn't Fort Condor. Fort Condor's over this way. I know where I'm going. It's fine. Uh, can't steer with a keyboard, though. <laughs> Can we land here? No, fine, I'll just go down manually. We do need to kill our friends, actually, before we do anything else. Right, round and round we go. Let's kill everybody. do si do Oh, it's you. You can teach us White Wind. And I've just taken Manipulate off. Oops, didn't mean to do that. It's fine, we didn't kill him. Just trying to kill my friends, don't mind me. Oh, Sid, right in the tummy. There we go, and then we'll kill this thing for a laugh, since we're here. Thank you, strange bird thing. Right. Down to Fort Condor, which is here. Oh yeah, we never came down here in the first place. <laughs> I guess we'll help. Begrudgingly. Okay. We're going to do the world's worst job at defending. Oh, I never. If you take uh, Kate Ketchy in here, Kate Sith, then they uh, they don't respond to that whole uh, I hate Shinra thing. Right, let's go fight. We're not going to play the actual mini game because the actual mini game sucks, in my opinion. We're just going to let them come up to the top and fight them manually. Hello. Oh no, I want to talk to man. There we go. Set the trap. Let the enemies fight. We know. We know. We know. We know. We know. Enough! <laughs> I'm ready! Uh, how do I... I don't want to... I just want to start the fight. Oh, there we go. Start the game. And now we play the waiting game. We've got time. How's everybody doing in the chat? <laughs> how do I make the speed go faster again? Uh, no. Oh, there you go. Perfect. I figured it out. I did the thing.
yeah, we just gotta wait for them to get to the top, then we'll have a have a disagreement with them, and then we'll be on our way. And then after that, I think it's uh, back to Medeal after that. Doing well, can't complain how things have been with you. Not too bad. Sorry, I know it has been a very long time since the last stream, but, you know, life has been a little bit hectic. But glad to hear things are going well. That's always good. We're, um... I think, like I said, I think the next major roadblock we've got in place on this run is carry armor. Because carry armor is a boss you fight in the underwater reactor who can basically grab... Um, a party member. Now, when, when you've got a party of three, that's not an issue. Well, it's still an issue, but it's not disastrous. Um, when you've only got one character and they get picked up by an arm, then that's game over. So we've got to find a way to get rid of the arms quickly. Which we have. There are options like Trine, um, Bolt 3, uh, Ultima, <laughs> like any of these big boy moves will do some damage to it, but I think I think the arms have got like 10,000 HP each. So, you need to do a lot of damage very quickly to stop them from uh, being an issue. Here they come. But we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. We've, got, we've still got to go... Uh, do we go to space before or after the reactor? I think we go to space after. Oh no, they're here. Oh, I was defending so hard. No, oh dear, what a problem. Hello. Ah, they're going to try and poison me. That's cute. Dun, 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 dun. Limit? Not quite. What we'll do is we'll wrap this up. Well, I've got a limit now, so this is basically over. Oh, it's still going. Oh, no, it's not. Never mind. I had a suicide move. Cool. Did it. Ah. I never understood this as a kid either. The condor nurtures a phoenix and basically gets obliterated by it. Roast chicken. Ow. We tried so hard. Will I go outside and have a look? Oh, if I press the right button, yes. Phoenix materia could be super useful if I act, if I need to get final attack materia. That will be a kind of a go-to. Okay, we're done here. Cool. Let's go save. We'll just leave here. We don't have to stay in here. There's literally no point. Get on the... On, on the there you go. Sometimes you can be very stubborn about that ladder. There it goes. Step. Marvellous stuff. Right, I'm going to save that. And I'm just going to take a very quick comfort break, so bear with me just two minutes. Okay, let's uh, patch up Barrett. He can use some healing, it's fine. No, not you. Close enough. So I think we have to go back to Medeal now. And um, we have to fight ultimate weapon. Well, I say ultimate fight. We have to just survive the fight with ultimate weapon. Uh, comfort break is uh, 
You know, I never really thought about it. I guess it is a British term. Uh, it's interesting. I, yeah, I guess I never really thought of it before. Did, did they not say comfort break over in... Uh, I, I believe it's America. You're, is it America you're based in, Scotch Seeker? I believe so. Um, why did I leave my deal? I know I left it here somewhere. There it is. Uh, let's save up here just in case things go wrong. I'm sure they don't. Yes, Hawaii. That's right. I remember now. Very jealous. <laughs> yeah, I guess comfort break is a British term. Yeah, I don't know. I, I never really thought... It's funny how, like, you you know, you live somewhere, you just accept it as part of the parlance, but you don't use that term. Uh, no, I get... Well, wait, where am I going? Um, yeah, I think it is a fundamentally British thing. Everything good? Am I not meant to be here? I'm sure I was meant to come here, wasn't I? Did I forget something? Have I forgotten something? Um, we'd be more crass in America. <laughs> well, we Brits do like to dance around the issue. We use all kinds of weird colloquial phrases to deal with uh, other things. Where am I? I'm sure I'm meant to come back here, aren't I? I've got the grant. I've got the huge material from Corel, and I've got it from Fort Condor. Do I have to go onto the deck of the ship? Is that? We've done Fort Condor, haven't we? Didn't we finish up at Fort Condor? Hold on, I'm gonna check a guide because I'm I'm pretty sure I was meant to go. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Did I miss something? It is very, very possible I missed something. So we did that. Oh, I'll speak to the old man inside the. Oh, I have to speak to the old man at the table. Oh, piddle ass. Fine. We'll go all the way back to bloody Fort Condor again. Where is it? There it is, just north of us. It's not even like a long distance, I'm just moaning. Oh, the ads. Oh, there were ads. I didn't know there were ads. When did I get ads? Oh, interesting. I did not know that. I assumed that they I assumed that there were ads when you first clicked onto the stream. I didn't realise you got ads midstream. That's a bit annoying. Maybe I'll look into that, see if there's anything I can do about that. I apologize. I hate adverts. Like whenever I'm watching a YouTube video and I have to watch thirty to sixty seconds worth of adverts first, it's just the worst. So you have my uh, apologies. <laughs> Hopefully they were good ads. Uh, just on the side. Oh, it doesn't stop the string. They just appear. Interesting. Okay. Gimme, gimme, gimme. There we go. Okay. Well, that's fine. We got it, we got it, we got it. That's right, so it mentions about the underwater material, underwater reactor, but we go to see Cloud first. That, okay, right, got it, got it, got it, got it. Back out we go. Have I been following the Olympics? No, but I do intend to. I do like the Olympics. Um, I've been a bit busy today with various bits and pieces, but I know that the opening... They did the big opening ceremony last night, didn't they? And then uh, there's been a few bits and pieces happening in the in the run up to it. But no, I do like the Olympics. I think they're a lot of fun. Uh, have you been watching anything in particular, Scotch Seeker? Right, back now to Medill, which thankfully really isn't too far away at all. Oh, we should uh, 
now let's save so we don't have to do all that again. Just in, just in case things go bad here. Which is an outside of possibility. Uh, to be honest, I love, I mean, obviously I'll watch anything like, I love all the track and field event stuff, but the thing I really love about the Olympics is when you find like the crazy like niche, well I say niche, the like less well-known sports that you wouldn't normally watch, like obviously in the Winter Olympics stuff like curling and um, uh, like skeleton and all those kind of like crazy um, events that you wouldn't naturally watch. I'm going to try to watch swimming, gymnastics and, oh there's a surfing competition, I did not know about the surfing, I might have to check that out. Are they doing skateboarding again this year? Skateboarding was quite fun last time they did that. Okay, now, if memory serves, this is just a survival fight. I just need to be alive at the end of it all. <laughs> Everything's fine. This is fine. Don't know if they're doing skateboarding. Ah, oh, that's a shame. I hope they do. I enjoyed skateboarding uh, last time. And like the BMX races and stuff like that. Be cool, bruh. Right, full on defensive mode. Big guard immediately. Ah, oh, you're going to get a move off first, aren't you? Oh, criminy, that hurts. Don't do that again. Just keep healing, just keep healing. Just keep healing. I know that the... Maybe I should use an elixir. Oh, this could be, this could be bad. Oh, no, we're okay, we're okay. Next potion, please. <laughs> <laughs> it's on the... Th oh, oh, he's going away. Oh, damn it. I wasted an X-Potion. Ah, oh, boo. Make a Discord server so, server so we can chat. <laughs> yeah, it's on the to-do list, Lim. To be honest, I don't... I need to catch up with Frenchie. Frenchie's like my go-to for stuff like that. Frenchie knows what's up. So I might have to catch up with her and see if she can take care of that for me. Ah, <laughs> oh, I can't believe I wasted an X-Potion there. Just one more turn would have gone. Frenchie is the best. Frenchie's amazing. Just a little bit more, I would have smashed him. Yeah, I like Barrett's confidence here. Okay, we're going to bail. Come on, Teeth, time to go. <laughs> Don't stress it, Liam. She thought it was funny. <laughs> right, off we go. I love this cutscene. It's so like out of place with all the other cutscenes. They, it's like they couldn't settle on what they wanted the graphical style to be for the game. Oh yeah, we've got to do the whole cloud livestream bit here. Okay, so we've got a, a barrack free section for a little bit, unfortunately. But, you know, hey-ho. We'll power through this, uh, this flashback. Wee. So interestingly, Scott, I think they were talking about adding esports. I think they were saying that esports was going to be in the future, like an Olympics thing. Maybe, I, maybe I'm wrong, but I'm sure I read somewhere that they were talking about introducing it. They're adding break dancing. That's amazing. I hope they do that. What do I do here? Oh yeah, just. 
keep hammering the okie dokie button. Now. We Oh yeah, this whole bit. So this is going to take a while, chaps. I'll be honest with you. We're going to be deprived of Daddy Barrett for a, a period of time here. Oh wait, no. Who do I start with? You? That's the way to do it. I don't want to shut up cloud. I do like how they recreated uh, Nibelheim in the the re rebirth and and remake stuff. It's a lot bigger than you expect it to be, but it's still very much got all the key points. Ah, oh, he looks so sad. So TLDR for anybody that doesn't know what's going on, uh, Cloud remembers that he wasn't the member of Soldier that came back here. That was Zack. Uh, but in fact, he was here, which Tifa didn't realise because he was one of the uh, so um, Shinra Grunt soldiers. I think the one on the right. No, Cloud, no. <laughs> There he is. So much backstory. I mean, this is a great... The first time you play through this game, this is like a great plot twist. This is a great reveal. When you've played through it and you know what's happening, this becomes a little bit laborious, but it's fine. Uh, I think it's this one next. I like the transitions as well. They're very nice. What's that line from uh, Machine Rich? Curse you, 13 year old Cloud. You know damn well you weren't looking at her eyes. <laughs> Nope, then he teleports up there. Nearly there, one more bit to go.
teeth are being super dense here as well. Last one. There's really not much that can be said over this whole situation. But once we get back to it, we'll have Cloud back in the party, and then I think that's when we're heading to the... I think that is when we're heading to the underwater reactor, which is where we're going to have issues. We can't really deny that. But I'm sure we'll figure them out. What I feel like we need to do is boost Barrett's magic power as much as possible and then just absolutely whammy the thing with, like, Trine and Ultima. I think we're nearly there now. Well, nearly there. I mean, they're going to talk a bit more. <laughs> oh dear. So I've actually been playing um, Chrono Cross. Still am playing Chrono Cross actually at the moment. Uh, Chrono Cross is a weird game. <laughs> uh, oh, cat in the chat! Thank you for uh, resubscribing. That was very kind of you. Thank you very much. Very, very kind. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, yeah, I've been playing Chrono Cross uh, at the same time. Chrono Cross is a Real strange cookie of a game. It's good, but it's also infuriating in places. <laughs> it is what it is. So, Chrono Cross is the follow up to Chrono Trigger. Um, it, near as I can tell, based on what I've experienced so far, it's set in the same kind of universe and continuation, but there's like. Um, yeah, it's just it's just a very different type of game. Lurking with intent, need these channel points for kitty treats. Yeah, I don't know where he is at the moment, but he is. Uh... He's been a bit naughty today. I think the heat's got to him because he's thrown up a couple of times. Which is a bit tragic for the little fella. Oh, well, there it goes. I mean, you'll have to bring him to me because I don't know where he is. <laughs> I've got treats ready. I think I've got treats in here somewhere. But I have no idea where the cat is. You'll find him. Okay, good, good.
The shop of Redentor. <laughs> he won't know what's going on, bless him. Oh, it's still incredibly uh, muggy and uncomfortable uh, here in the UK. Yeah, it's not not great. Oh no! Now the oh two treats. Oh the poor little fella. He's gonna be. He doesn't know whether he's coming or going anymore. Two treats for the kitty. That's very kind of both of you. Thank you very much. I will have to. Uh, I think I've got a pack of treats in here somewhere. Oh, no, I can see them back there. It's fine. I'll go and grab them as soon as the cat emerges from wherever he's hiding. I will make sure he gets both treats. Oh, in fact, that's there's a knock at the door. That's him right now. He's learned how to knock on the door. Bear with me. There you go, so this is your first one. What are you doing? <laughs> You're being very special. Let go of my arm. Stop wriggling. Oh my god, you're such a wriggle bum. Right, there's the second one. Just staring off into the middle distance. All right, say thank you to the people. Yeah, there's a, there's a half-assed meow that came out in there. I mean, the cat's smart, Scott Seeker. He can do many things. <laughs> right, where were we in this whole backstory? Oh, he's dribbled right over my arm there. Lovely. To the reactor! Ugh. Got cat slobber all over my arm. Oh, there she goes. Off sack goes. He doesn't do super well. There he goes. He saw it all because he was there the whole time. I love the use of heartbeats in this game. It's very uh, atmospheric. And chunk. Although I did see there's a very, very nice... Uh, I don't... I, I've got to feel like it's a deliberate choice. Um, so there's videos pointing this out, but like people are often like, well, how did... Cloud as this like grunt soldier managed to get the drop on Sephiroth. If you look at what Cloud's got equipped in the Nibelheim flashback, he has the preemptive materia, which basically lets you have uh, a higher ATB in combat. Which I think I, I really, really want that to be a deliberate choice because that would be amazing if they were like giving an in-universe reason as to how he got the drop on Sephiroth. Uh, Is this on autopilot? I can't remember. I think it is. Yeah, this is all just running on its own pace now. Zack's sword went through his eye there, but we don't question that. Towards the time. The PS1 could only do so much. But yeah, as a as a plot twist, this was a great plot twist.
And Seth Dog was talking to us. That's us down there, slowly dying. We were the hero all along. So I think what we'll do tonight is we'll get to the point where we get uh, back in control of Barrett. And then what I'll probably do is off stream before the next one, I'll... Uh, level up Barrett to the point where the cure material has regen because I feel, I feel like we need regen before we can take on um, carry armor and probably bolt three as well so I might spend a bit of time just leveling up both of those material but I won't make you guys sit through that because that'll be just boring and repetitive so we'll just finish this whole flashback sequence get back in control get Barrett back in the party and that's probably where we'll call the stream for tonight. Ah, uh, hoop! God, that's bright. Come on, Cloud, come together like a Megazord. <laughs> I forgot I used the uh, the blongs, the noise. <laughs> that was an odd choice. He's okay, folks. More or less. You stupid jerk. Tifa showing some good bedside manner there. Up we go. Cloud sleeps with his eyes open, Tifa doesn't. She's fine. There we go. Cloud's brief hiatus is over. Not that it matters because we don't need him. Come on. Ooh, the 
the uh, infiltration into Midgar's going to be fun as well if we can get past carry armor. I'm looking forward to that bit. Although we do have to fight the Turks, that's going to be difficult. Not impossible, but difficult. Unless we do go through and do the Wu Tai side quest. I don't really want to do that though. Ain't nobody getting off of this train. Ha 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 ha. Well then. And there we go. Right, let's just get... Oh, wait. No, oh, there we go. There we go. Right, Barrett and... Who else is... Oh, you're both dead. Let's bring Ketchy along for the ride. Why not? Underwater reactor! That's the next stop. So let's fly to Junin and then that's where we'll call the stream for tonight. But we're back on it, baby. We're back on the road. We'll park up here. And next time will be carry armor. I need to do some prep work for Karyama. Karyama is going to be nasty. Uh, but there we go. We have saved it. Perfect. And we will do Karyama next time. So thank you very much again. Sorry it's been so long. I'll promise the next stream won't be quite so... Uh, there won't be such, such a big gap between the next stream. Uh, thank you very much to Scotch Seeker, Liam from the East, um, Cat in the Chat, on the Scar Mill, everybody that's turned up to say howdy doody. It's good to be back. It's nice to see you folks again. Hope you're all doing well. Uh, enjoy the rest of your time whatever you're up to uh you too buddy you too liam make sure you get some rest right i know it's early in the morning for you uh take care guys and i will see you on the next one ta for now